people, what we got right here is an update on my little plenty friends. I'm gonna hit you guys with a fun fact, and that is I actually had all the videos made for the rest of that week. Like you guys saw in uh, one of my videos, I went out of town and I pre recorded everything and actually did the audio while I was there, but I did it in the 20 in 20 degrees out in the snow in the middle of the day sitting outside with my laptop just talking to it in front of my family all my cousins were clowning on me and I did that so I could keep on track with this with this schedule I've created and unfortunately I was on a military base and I don't know my cousin said the the radars are probably messing up the signal and such it just would I couldn't do anything on the internet like almost, I could almost do nothing, like upload wise or Instagram wise or anything wise like that. So sorry for that. I'm um, gonna do this video now, and uh, just so you know, I'm gonna catch up on all the videos. That means for at least two weeks, expect four videos a week. It's all. It's. I mean, it's not hard for me. I got them recorded, like I said before. So ha, huh? enjoy that. Now, what we're gonna talk about right now is mistakes, and that's okay because this channel is dedicated to the progression of myself in this hobby, and with progression comes mistakes. So, what did I do this time? If you guys saw my last plant video, you saw me plant all these plants in the plants plant 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 tank, and I buried the rhizomes, the rhizomes, the that thick. That thick caterpillar-like vein that runs along the uh, Java fern in Anubius, that's not supposed to be buried. I buried it. I made a mistake. Thank you guys for pointing it out. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Because of that, I was immediately able to sh just, just kind of shimmy it out, make sure that the roots are still in, but that vein, that main vein, was not. This way, uh, it was able to gain some nutrients and such and able to... Uh, actually grow and, and thrive in the tank and it did good it did good to, for a while and I did this until I was able to actually go to Walmart or one of these stores and actually get some thread so I could tie them down to rocks now because of you guys I was able to save about forty dollars and as you guys know a penny saves is a penny earned so thank you for making me forty bucks so what I'm doing right here is actually uh actually I've removed the plants that I wanted to take out the Java fern. I left the Anubius because when I got them, they were about the size of a quarter, and I was actually unable to fully bury them. So what I did was just kind of shove the roots into the gravel, and they're doing great. So I'm gonna leave those alone. There's no point in messing with something that you that's that's doing great, right? I don't think so. So actually, I just kind of took the Java fern, found the flattest rocks I could find. Now what I did was actually take the Java fern, tie it to the rock, and the reason I'm doing this is because I wanted to give the illusion of being buried without being actually buried. So the flattest rocks allow me to bury the rock, except for the little bit that the root or that 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 uh, thick vein is actually out. Okay, I'm able to, as you can see, just kind of shove rocks around it, and when these plants actually fill up or fill in or grow, whatever word you want to use, they're gonna look like they're just they're coming out of the substrate but they're not they're actually on top of the substrate and I was able to do this by finding the flattest rocks possible so now that everything's in the tank everything is looking good everything is looking happy everything is fan freaking tastic and I hope you guys enjoyed the video and thank you for helping me on this why do I, I hate saying the word mistake on this mishap that I actually uh caused so please Leave a comment below. Let me know exactly what that 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 vein is called. And like pronounce it for me, please, because I am so I don't even know how to say it. And hit that like button if you like saving money or you like saving me money. And uh subscribe. I got videos coming at you at least three times a week for the month of Ms. Arch. And check out the Facebook, Instagram, and Tumblr. And above all else, do amazing things like attach a Nas to a turtle and then put it in a turtle race. Until next time, guys, take like a boss. Because you're a boss, and that's how bosses take.